Here we go, bro. <laughs> All right. I don't trust shooting counselors. <laughs> oh, this is um. These used to be somewhat sentimental. Now they are playtesting sleeves. Because you notice the color scheme on this. It's red and black. Mm -hmm. My ex's favorite guild was Rakdos, red and black. And so they have turned into playtesting slaves. <laughs> There's a little history of T1 Glistenerl for you, I suppose. I win. Oh, you do. There you <laughs> go. I, I think for once you were you were due a win. I'll be on the play. All right. It seems like you got a bunch in a row, and then I got a bunch in a row. Uh, sure, I'll keep this. Likewise, I'll keep. Go ahead. All right. Uh, Spire Bluff Canal, pass turn. <laughs> oh, that dog. That dog. Uh, I see a hunt master. So they simply cost one less, and this gives it haste. Yeah, cool. Go ahead. All right. Well, I would like to cast a cathartic reunion as an additional cost. Got a sack. Got to drop some stuff, so we're gonna drop an angel of intervention and a vona butcher. You need to not knock the tripod over, please. Um, okay. Yeah. Start of the video. His dog is uh, it's being a little hyper. Okay. So results. Yeah. Well, All right. Cool. Rumi's dog. Oh, Rumi's dog. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Okay. And then pass turn. Vona, Angel, and Cathartic Reunion. Let's scoot this back a bit. Check the camera to make sure we're still on. We're still on. Okay. So I actually have a lot more room for that than I thought I did. But yeah, if you're wondering, you two, why I'm playing lands up in front, it's because I don't have a play mat and I can't quite see because of the angle where everything is. So, just to be on the safe side, lands up in front. Is that two creatures? Yeah, two creatures. Oh, we have that stupid <laughs> dinosaur. Death Force Scavenger. Alright, which one do you want to hit? Uh, hit that yep. one. Vona is the correct answer, I think. Gain two? Yep. Yes, that because there's nothing for it to target. So, give it haste. Yep. Attack. Trigger. Exile Angel. Yep. Game two. I'll take three. Yep. And faster. All right. There is so much graveyard hate in the format. Why am I <laughs> running this deck? I like it when it does happen to do its thing. But. Admittedly, that's <laughs> a lot of it. I would like to cast Gate to the Afterlife. Sure. Pass turn. Four. Some at the tested. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't like my odds on that one, so. Uh, she's going to go to five. Yeah, I think, okay, so double strike. Targeting Death Gorger. Mm hmm. Uh, other combat. She don't want to tar target the Huntmaster. Oh, sure. Good combat. <laughs> yeah. Swing. Trigger. Uh, XL. All right. Later. Feel like That's taking nine? Buff it to four. Yeah, nine. Go ahead. The seven. It's seven is the old. Okay, mm -hmm. cool. Cool. Double strike. Double strike is a thing, I suppose. Champion of Wits. 
So you know what this does? Enters, no. draw two, discard two. It's what? draw equal to its power, then discard two. So okay. draw two, discard two. So here come two. Let's see what I'm about to drop. Let's see. We're going to drop Angel of Intervention mm -hmm. and... Gate to the afterlife. Okay. All right. And then pastor. Oh crap! I was supposed to play a land. Oops. It's fine. It is what it is. Uh. Plus turning death death forge. Mhm. Mm I sort of put myself in autopilot and. Made a mistake. Savage stomp. Alright. Target Death Gorge. Yep. Champion down. This is this fight or deals yeah, damage? It's fight. Okay, so it doesn't matter anyway because it has three toughness, but there you go, so I'm dead. Yep. So it, the extra land didn't matter. It was this fire bluff canal, would have come in tap, okay. so didn't matter anyway. Sideboards! Yay! I'm optimistic about what did you say, Cradle 2.0 in modern? Yeah. I'm optimistic about it. Uh, the something of Itlamac. No, that's the blue one, isn't it? The green enchantment from Ixalan that yeah. turns into Guy's Cradle that can also just make green mana if you get wrapped. Right. There we go. That that one. Do 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 do. I'm not looking doo -doo. through that trust her box. So I would like to be on the play. Yep. I still, I still try to make myself think about it each time, just in case. Sure. Likewise. All right. Ready? Mm -hmm. Evolving Wilds. I'm just going to save us some time and get an island and pass the turn. Mm -hmm. All right. So, just while you're taking your turn, this is standard. It won't take too long. Go ahead. There we go. All right, my friend. Would you like... To get my deck. Draw does not change anything. Ta da! Strategic planning. Look at the top three. One goes in my hand, the other two go in the grave. Yep. Evolving Wilds, Combustible Gear Hulk will be the ones going into the grave. Alright, cool, and pass turn. Because this is standard, and we aren't playing anything after that. He's back. Guess who's back? Good. Back again. Okay, I was hoping that would be a two-syllable word, so I could say that, you know, no. and continue the song a bit. It is three. Yeah. Yup. Yup. Well, this is a little bit awkward. That's not a card I want to cast right this second. So, instead, we're going to play a mountain, and we're, we're, we're going to pass the turn. That's the uh, Enraged Draw card? Yeah. Okay. Keep haste. Mm hmm. Beat haste for four. Alright, I'll be taking four. Blip, 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 blip. Go ahead. Something I debated doing earlier. I think it's fine now. A braid. Yep. I thought about doing it. Bolt the bird, essentially. Yep. Probably should have, but we made it. Gimme. Gains control, I skip my untap step. Okay. Alright, pass turn. Well, I don't skip my untap, I just 
lands I control don't untap during my next untap step. So I'll untap the creature, just not the lands. So, just to clarify that, I, I did misspeak. <laughs> <laughs> Are we prepared to both draw a card in a turn? <laughs> Alright. That's good? Yep. Hmm. Pass turn. There's my swamp. Sheep Oasis, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, sack the Oasis plus three plus three. Yep. Alright. Stop. Okay. So, Enrage will trigger on both of us, we'll both yep. draw a card. So I'm getting, eight. getting hit for eight. Yep. Okay. Fair enough. Hey. That's what happens when your lands are right next to it, I suppose. Hostage taker. Who? Again, I say, gimme. And this is. Yeah, admittedly it does. And then I'll um, pass the turn. Um, give me back. All right. No haste for you. Oh my goodness! There we go. Um, can you? Yes. They sound so cute. Um, Your kittens sound so cute. Uh, Death Watch. Oh. Okay. Plenty of options. <laughs> Plenty of options. Uh, um. Thankfully, not enough to cast it yet. Go ahead. In a turn, cycle, river winder. Yep. And tapity tap tap. Draw. Strategic planning. Mm -hmm. Looking at the top three. Champion of Wits, Spire Bluff Canal. Yep. Ether Hub, I have one energy. Yep. It's there. We're just gonna understand that it's there, but I'm not using it just yet. I'm gonna do this. There we go. But gimme gimme. And then has to turn, a braid in the turn cycle. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I got the wrong ring. I mean, gee. I thought I knew how this was going to go. Maybe not. Trevor? Sure. Death Forge. I'm sorry. Oh, okay, you did tap three. Okay. Yeah. Death Gorge, uh, trigger. Uh, I have okay. Champion of Wits. Champion of Wits. Okay. There's the, there's the card. Mm. Okay. Go ahead. Wait. 
what on earth are you doing not scavenging grounds now? I don't know, actually, never mind. I guess we want the recursive graveyard hate, which is fair, which is fair. That's, that's certainly fair. I, I do actually, I, I don't mean to sound harsh, I am actually curious as to why you didn't do it then, but you can tell me in just a second, you don't have to do it right now. That said, one of the issues with doing that is, Etherhub, actually two, now, two energy. God Pharaoh's gifts. Mm -hmm. No, yeah. Oops. Oops. Alright, my friend. I'm ready to go to combat. Mm -hmm. Beginning of combat trigger. Combustible Gear Hulk is going to come in. Um, yeah. Alright, cool. So, it's exile, but we're gonna pretend that this is it. Combustible Gear Hulk triggers. Mm -hmm. You know how his trigger work? No. Okay. So you have the choice. You can either let me draw three cards, or I will mill three... I, I did that one. That, that time it wasn't the doll. Or I will mill three, and you will take damage equal to the CMC of those cards. Mmm. -hmm. Mill three. Mill three? And is it CMC, uh, let me, let me look at the text just to make absolutely sure. If the player doesn't put the top three into your graveyard, then it deals damage. Okay, so the total converted mana cost. Uh, you take 11. So it's Strategic Planning 2, Nimble Obstruction is 3, stri uh, Striped River Winder 7, which is 12 actually. So, I'm sorry, I saw the 6 and apparently it overrode the rest of me, saying that's not right. Um, but yeah, we have a combustible gear hulk around here. Um, yeah, charge. Um, charge. It's a four four first strike. No, it's four four. Yes, four four first strike. Take four. All right. And then I will pass the turn. Can I give you a, a word of advice? Scavenging grounds. I have a hostage taker in my graveyard, so even if you attack with the Death Gorge Scavenger, you still probably want to take more than just the one card. I mean, you could definitely wait till main phase two to do it, though. Yeah. So, my creatures are, I have a Hostage Taker, a Striped River Winder, which is a 4-4 Hexproof, I think. It is a 5-5 Hexproof. I have a Nimble Obstructionist, which will be a 4-4 Flyer, um, and another River Winder. Yeah. And if you feel like making it a 4-3, we have lots of choices for you. Yeah. Strategic Planning times uh, 3. Uh, On the beats. Um, exile. Obstructionist? Yeah. You'll gain two? Okay. And then. Grounds. Nom 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 nom. Um, so you get. Um, that's a 3 3 now, so. 3 3 and a 3 2. Yeah, I think I. Sh I can't think of your ability to deal two damage post-combat in this deck, so I think I'm okay with going to two here. Go ahead. Alright. Cathartic Reunion. One. Two. Discard two. Champion of Wits. And... Um, say, Evolving Wilds. I mean, you already know where this is going. Mm -hmm. And then draw three. One, two, three. Mm 
two, three. Well, actually we have options. Actually we have options. But I think it best right now to, I would elect to go to combat. Yeah, I will I don't just mean. bring back, yeah, yeah, you, you know how this goes. We, we ended up drawing into a Braid and Gear Hulk and Obstructionist, so I just drew perfectly right there. So, game three, shenanigans. Let's, uh, let's not forget that's yours. Alright, game three. Up in the floor. Fair enough. I'm not liking the sound of that. Let's see what we have going on in this seven. Ooh. You know, I'm not... Mmm, I ain't gonna keep. I ain't gonna keep. I am going to keep. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So let me, let me show you why, ladies and gents. Here we go. Flip this screen around. Okay, cool. So this, when you consider the rest of the hand, looks super risky. This makes it a little bit better. This, if we can get there, is pretty sick. And then, look how loaded this side of the game is. If we can get there is the trick. Uh, I do very much like you. We're gonna see how well that treats me. It is not something that I've seen in a lot of other lists like this. I don't know how good it is against him, but I couldn't take it out either. So we're gonna try it. We're gonna see if we can get there. Risk it for the biscuit. Risk it for the biscuit. Here we go. Let's see what six and a half grants you, my friend. All right, all right, all right, all right. You know what that's from? Mm -hmm. All right, all right, all right. There's a movie that I know of that has it in there, but I doubt you've seen that movie. Okay. I will get to that in just a sec. Oh, oh no, you, no lands. Oh, uh, there's one that wants a ticket. Oh. All right, um, so are we doing six and a half again? Or are we doing five and a half here? I guess since this is standard and this is something that we're going to actually see more frequently, I guess we should do five and a half, but I don't, I feel, even though that's the way it's supposed to be played, I feel bad doing that. Yeah, I'll tell you what, we're both in standard. We should probably play this for practice sake, the way we're supposed to do it. Let's do five and a half. I'm sorry, man. This one. If it gets worse, we'll, we'll stop at five and a half, though. No, no lower than that. I want to have a slightly interesting game. And it could very well be the case that my hand hates me, so don't worry. I'll keep it. All right. Yeah. Here you kitty. The slight bit of OCD in me says to do this to the deck. There we go. Alright. So You're up? Worst commune. <laughs> Every hand is capable of the commune in it. Although flavorfully, commune with dinosaurs. I get commune with nature. That kind of makes sense. Commune with dinosaurs? Fruit uh, don't crack. I mean, I guess. Okay. Go ahead. Alright, cool. An island, pass the turn. Cycle? Yep. Untap draw. Mm -hmm. Just draw one card, please, Jay. <laughs> I'll pass the turn. I'm afraid I can't bolt the bird just yet. Yeah, that's. 
that's a thing. I give it haste. Mm hmm. Be face for four. Blip, 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 blip. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. Champion of Wits? Yep. Combustible Angel? Mm -hmm. There's a... That should be a car, Combustible Angel, somewhere in Unstable. Past turn? I did, yeah, I did play a land, didn't I? Yep. Okay, good, good. Making sure I wasn't going crazy. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay, whoa, 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 we gotta stop right here. We gotta stop right here because I wanna show this off. This is an RK Post dinosaur token. Tyranitar for the win. For additional context, other than it's awesome, he and I both still play Pokemon Go, so I use it as a motivation to keep moving. Give and it up, gets haste. Give the alpha haste. Yep. Yeah, just Hello. to be clear, this does not have any keywords of its own. It grants haste to the others. All those donors get haste. Yeah, yeah. Mm. And it doesn't have tram. Okay. So I'm this looking one has at a lot. This one has just the one with trample. Okay. Hmm. Alright, doing a price check real quick. We're already looking at 11 across the board. 4-4-3. Mm -hmm. four, four, I think I can't block something, so we're gonna we're gonna block the Regisar Alpha so that I'll only take seven this turn. All right. That's alright. Put me down to nine. And, uh, a little too much. Why? Um... This is unfortunate. I have three lands in hand. They all come intact. Ooh. Hmm. Okay. So looking at this, this is... I'm at nine. I'm looking at... 11, 12, notwithstanding anything else you could play. Might as well play an Evolving Wilds while I'm at it. And then we'll play a Trophy Mage, fail to find. Okay. Tells you a little bit about my hand. Last turn, fetch, because why not? What does trophy man search for? Uh, can, an artifact with CMC equal to three. Mm. It's a swamp, by the way, that I'm getting. Okay. Just in case hostage taker decides to show up, come into the party. Tyranitar, you, you jerk. You jerk. How do you want to end? Um, fire and ice, please. <laughs> you can cast both of those, so yeah. go for it. Show, show me your moves. Well, Savage Stomp. I have to Savage Stomp. Kill the Trophy the Mage. Draw a card. Yeah. And actually, never mind, we can't cast both unless you feel like destroying your own dinosaur. You don't even have yeah, to, though. Right. Whenever it's dealt damage, you can abrade your own creature to draw a card. Yeah. So I did that. 
I mean, he's got, he has the win, so. <laughs> so I'll show you. I had two Evolving Wilds. Obviously, you saw the third Evolving Wild. Yep. And a Kepnest last board. So given one more... Now, granted, if I stole your creature, it would still be tapped. But that means you have one fewer attackers. Yep. So I could have made it one more turn with a Kepnest last board there. Of course, if I did that, I also still have Iron Trout, so I'd just be blocking your dude. Uh, mm -hmm. I also had a Nimble Obstructionist and another Gear Hulk. Uh, Obstructionist, I was hoping I could hold up for a trigger off of your sca what, Scavenger? Is that what it's called? The dinosaur Death that eats scavenger. Death Guard Scavenger. There we go. Um, but that did not come to be. And it could cycle for another land if I needed. I think I needed the Champion of Wood. Yeah, I, I don't know that I could have won that game. Off of five and a half, by the way. Very good, my friend. So sideboards. I put in... Obviously, kept his left board. I did a a neat little sideboard thing I've seen talked about. I do not think that it is right, but I tried it. Uh, I took out all of the gate of the afterlife. I should have left one in for trophy mage because this is a trophy mage variant of the list. Not all lists run trophy mage. Mm. I should have kept one, and that might have made the difference. No, no, it wouldn't have. Gate would not have made a difference there at all. Um, thins my deck, I suppose, to find a parade or something like that. Or an untapped land. Aside from that, one parade is main board, one is sideboard. I would like to find some room for more. I'm working on that. Maybe take out a land, honestly. Um, beyond that, let's see, Hostage Taker is not main board. It is four of in the sideboard. There's one swamp to try to go and cast them reasonably. Other than that, it's two Kefnet's last word for decks like yours, mid-range decks. Uh, a one a braid for dealing with... I understand you have a few cards. I see you, Ferocidon, <laughs> in addition to the Scavenger. Uh, and then Hostage Taker, for the same reason as Kefnet's last word, except it lets me actually cast yours on the next turn if I need to. Mm -hmm. So, um, the more that I look at it, the more that I think that this is not quite the meta for the deck. But I love seeing a janky deck like this in Standard, and I can't help but play it. That said, I'm going to be trying out something something else in the future, so we'll see what that is. I want to get back to my land destruction roots, I suppose. It's oh, going to be a slow game. It is going to be a slow... Land destruction should not beat you, though, because you'll get one or two creatures out before I can start looping land destruction, and you'll just beat me with those. Mm -hmm. The joys of land destruction in standard. When your cheapest mana ramp creature is two mana and your cheapest land destruction is four, there's one three mana land destruction in the format. That's not really a thing, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Now for cards aside, and by the way, that one three mana is Nissa's defeat. And it only hits forest. Mm -hmm. So I took out Avona Butcher of Truth, two Angels of Intervention, which I was struggling to take out, and I, I mentioned this earlier, four gates to the afterlife. Which should have only been three. And then maybe I take out an Abrade. You don't really have any artifacts and you have a few creatures, toughness three or less, but I don't know that they were enough to warrant the second Abrade. Four. Yeah, four scavengers would be nice. Um, we'll get there. Alright, one Vona. I have yet to see Vona come into play, if I'm not mistaken. I think a braid actually hits everything but the alphas and... And your Ripjaw? Well, yeah, Ripjaw and... Carnage? Carnage. Yeah, there's, there's a lot that it doesn't hit, even though so, that's only like 10 or 11 cards. It's still a decent chunk of your deck, unfortunately. It's like 9. It's oh, it's 9? Nine? Nine. Okay. Yeah. Well, maybe I was off on that then. Well, in any case, thank you for jamming another game with me, and in the meantime, I need to work on this deck. So, we'll give it another go later on.